people, this is Spray Love. And this one I am going to talk about probably the most popular fragrance amongst fragrance enthusiasts that I've ever seen. I got a sample recently of Creed Aventus. In fact, I got the sample today and um, I have it right here on my wrist because it dripped one half like one half of a spray on my hand put it on my wrist and this one is a confirmed beast mode I can smell it at all times just on my wrist from like half a spray and it's been hours um, beast mode fragrance uh, I could smell it outside while uh, having my hands in my pocket I could smell it from my hand it's wow great for that projection longevity everything the performance uh, so is it worth the price for me absolutely not for other people yeah probably why because the ingredients are superb like I'm pretty sure it's natural ingredients for the most part um, smells good smells super good like it's master craftsmanship like a fragrance there's a master nose behind that uh, I don't know who but it's it's awesome it's just awesome for me um, it smells good you know and uh, I, I even like uh, made it smell to a my roommate here and uh, she's a girl like uh, a bit younger than me and uh, I made her smell and she was like wow this smells good but not more and then I told her what it was and how expensive it is and um, she was like oh really <laughs> because she had probably also smelled a lot of other fragrances in my collection that were like costly as compared to this and uh, that uh, she liked better, maybe she found more uh, attractive, or maybe whatever. And uh, it's the same for me. Um, like, it smells like a designer fragrance of this. Like, it smells like a, a designer fragrance that would have gotten into the steps of becoming a high, like high-end fragrance, and be like at the zenith of the high-end fragrances, you know, because it's super well done, super well blended, well thought of, bravo everyone, this is a masterpiece, but um, it still smells like a, a cool, a likable, musky scent, uh, yeah, that uh, we can see at other places uh, costing a lot less, you know, like uh, uh, Musque Imperial. Atelier Cologne, Musque Imperial, uh, that I did a video on. This one is super amazing. Uh, I like it maybe a little more in the dry down than uh, Creed Aventus even. But I think that Creed Aventus is probably m more like well balanced. It's just that for me, uh, I prefer the just very, very musky, uh, darker scent. And uh, Creed Aventus is maybe a little too bright for me um, on that area. But uh, yeah, uh, the Kalong has a lot of natural ingredients, it's really well blended, has a dry down similar, and costs a lot less. Still costs a bit more than the usual fragrance that you would find in a, in a store, but uh, it costs like, a, maybe I don't know, a quarter of the price, uh, an eighth of the price. And then afterwards, uh, I will probably uh, try to get a hand on the Mont Blanc Explorer just to see uh, uh, if if really there's uh, so many resemblances to Aventus. What I can tell you is that uh, Club de Nuit Etance for, for Rome is really not worth it because it's um, it does cost a lot less, but it smells very synthetic and uh, like not too acidic, very 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 acidic and uh, um, it smells more like uh, those industrial soaps you know I, I don't really like it whereas like Aventus smells very refined and musky and nice and oh it's it's bliss you know 
that's not it in its bliss. Um, some people might really like be all in for Aventus, and I encourage you to go and buy that and make that your signature scent because it's going to cost a lot less, less than me that collecting all those scents <laughs> for nothing. I should only get one and uh, it would be okay. But uh, nevertheless, I like collecting and a lot of people like it, so <laughs> to each his own. But if someone wanted to make a signature scent, that one, it would be worth the price because you buy that and uh, you have it for like two years because you spray once or twice. <laughs> it's like so beast mode. Um, it's perfect. And you want that fragrance to be a bit like a second skin because of the must, because of the pineapple. So spray once or twice, uh, a bit like uh, if you would spray Baccarat Rouge uh, 540. So, um, but yeah, I, I, I made it smell to my roommate and she was like, yeah, it's really good. Uh, I think that she, she definitely would find things that she liked better in my collection than Aventus. And it's all cheaper than Aventus. And um, there's fragrances that I have that are high-end, like Neroli Outre Noir and uh, Mon Précieux Nectar from Guernet. These are like complete masterpieces and it just gets me completely away. It's just like I was reading a book or listening to music or it's like art. It's getting me into another plane of time and everything. So good, so 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 good. Those two fragrances, and Aventus doesn't do that for me that much. And even the designerish, because you can compare it to something more designerish. First of all, from uh, Parfum de Marly, uh, I must admit, I like it better. Why? When I spray it on, it's not a better scent. It's like citrusy and uh, pretty pretty boring if you uh, if you really think about it, but. It makes me smile, and uh, it makes people around me smile, and uh, it makes people want to hug me, and it, wants, it makes me want to hug me. <laughs> what I'm s saying is that it's just like a, an easy, like easy reach, but always positive. It always makes me smile. Um, Aventus, it's like oh, it's gorgeous. It's so gorgeous, but it doesn't have that little thing that would make it. A must have for me and uh, but it must like for some people it is and it's one of the most popular fragrances in history so I cannot say much more about that um, spread love if you like Aventus too and uh, um, don't go after me saying oh you don't like Aventus oh you just I don't care it's just like it's it's done for me and I'm happy that it's done for me because it costs so much <laughs> Maybe I'll find another creed and be like, oh my god, I want to do an Irish tweet, you know, but I don't want that to happen because, well, I can spend my money on other fragrances. <laughs> and maybe you'll get your kick from there and be happy with that. So, alright, spread love, pray love, bye bye.